Hi and welcome to part 17 of how to build an e-commerce website using Django and Vue.js. In this part I'm going to make these forms look prettier. So the first thing I'm going to do is to go into VS Code and open login.html. Instead of rendering the form like this, I'm going to use Bulma to render the form. First I'm going to insert a, a hidden field. You type hidden name next value next. This is a value we get from Django automatically and this is where the user will be redirected if you try to visit a page it was not supposed to go to. And then here I say div class field div class control input type text class input name username id id username. This is how Django usually creates the field. Label username. Like that. I can copy this. Paste it. Password. Input type. Password. Name. Password. ID. ID underscore. Password. Then I can remove this. And at the bottom here, I just want to loop through the errors if form.errors and if div class notification is danger your user name and password didn't match please try again like that and save so if I now go back here refresh the form looks better if I try to log in now I get this error down here perfect and also add a column around this div class columns div class column is 6 is offset 3 and then I move the whole form into that paste it save and refresh no sorry just do that so now it's smaller and it's at the center of the screen perfect so now I want to do the same to the sign up form before I continue I just want to say thanks to my patreons if you too want to support me, you will find a link to my Patreon in the description below. This is done a little bit different, because there are multiple ways of changing how a form is rendered. I want to do it two different ways. So we have diff this way. And for the sign up form, we go into forms.py. And below here, I need to add a class to all of the different fields. So here I just said def init self args kwargs super sign up form self init so I call the original function as well kwargs self.fields username dot widget dot atters class equals input and save so if I now refresh okay something no just didn't reload text input says no no it's supposed to be atters refresh and now the username field looks much better so I can just copy this now do the same for email do the same for password 1 password 2 first name and last name refresh now it looks better I want to 
minimize no sorry I want to make this font a little bit smaller so in my main.css file I say form dot help text font size 12 12 pixels and the color can be CCC refresh now it's smaller and much brighter so it isn't too hard to look at also just want to hide this form ul display none like that so now this also looks much better but I can also go to sign up.html and create the columns here as well. Dave class column is six is offset six. Oops, no, the offset should also only be three, like that. So now the forms looks much better. And that was it for today. It was a short video, but I hope you liked it.